I think. Nashapai, the star leopardess of Nabosho Private Conservancy. She is the daughter of Musiara aka Rani. In 13 years of her life, she raised only one litter to adulthood, and that is Nashapai and her sister Nima. At present, Nashapai is the star female cheetah of Masai Mara, and her four cubs are the stars of Nabosho Private Conservancy. The five-year-old daughter of Rani, Nashapai appeared in this conservancy with four two-and-half-month-old cubs, and they are both male and female. Nashapai and her four cubs are hungry from few days, and they need a hunt to fill their tummies. Mother is busy scouting for hunt. The elder cub in the family is assigned to guard his siblings. From a certain distance, she was scouting the herd of Impalas. The cubs are under a thorn tree in a shade. With age, the cubs became more active. It became more difficult for Nashapai to leave them for a long time. If it's late, cubs can start calling Nashapai, thereby attract the attention of other predators, which can cost them their lives. While Nashapai is targeting the Impala herd, a giraffe accidentally bumped into the territory. Giraffe has no threat as it is not lion's pride. Cheetahs never target giraffes or bigger size animals. Nashapai is hungry and she is scouting all around for her easiest prey. Usually cheetahs hunt impalas and they are the easiest prey. Hence they fell to the lords of jungles like leopards and cheetahs. Gazelles too are the easiest prey but they run faster equal to cheetah with their short legs. Young impalas and calves are the easy targets at times for these predators. This impala herd is big and has many adult males and females. It's not easy for Nashapai to hunt in open. Impalas can't run faster than cheetah. She chose to ambush from the bushes as impalas are very closer to the bushes. Usually leopards use this tactics in Masai Mara to hunt from the bushes but not cheetahs. Nashapai is clever and she has to hunt for her four cubs. Cubs have started eating the meat as they stopped suckling milk from her mother and have become bloodthirst. Ambushing from bushes is the best and easiest way for Nashapai to hunt.
Nashapai succeeded in hunting. She ambushed from the bushes and killed a fully grown adult female impala. With its keen senses of sight, hearing and smell all aid in hunting, a hyena saw the killing by Nashapai. Hyena immediately came towards the cubs. Cubs are scared and ran far, leaving their lunch to hyena. Hyena the scavenger stole the impala and dragged inside the bushes. jumped into action and stole the meal from Hyena and took it far. Since it is a private conservancy and the rangers guarding Nashapai and her cubs has all rights to protect the meal. They traveled quite afar and dropped the dead impala under a tree in an open land. Soon Nashapai and her cubs followed the safari jeep and joined the meal. It's the same place where they were resting. All thanks to the rangers for feeding them in an afternoon under a hot sun. Nashapai resting under a tree for a few minutes after a magnificent hunt. Her cubs are hungry mouths, and it's a great lunch for them. With their tiny teeth, they are trying to tear the skin and sucking the blood. She understood her cubs are feeding under a hot sun. And she gently dragged the meal under the shade. Nashapai has raised her four cubs with greater difficulty. Her cubs are grown up and they don't feed milk anymore. She introduced solid food to the cubs. Cheetah mothers while growing litter. They go to hunt at distances between three to 10 kilometers from the place where the cubs are taking care. Cheetahs are built for sheer speed, making them the fastest land mammal on the planet Earth with an estimated speed of 110 kilometers per hour. Speed gives them an added advantage to ambush and catch the prey. It's also a disadvantage to them. 
in that after killing they have to rest for more than 20 minutes before starting to feed on the prey. Giving advantages to hyenas, jackals, and other small predators who can easily scare and chase them away as they are very fearful. With those tiny teeth and not a fully grown canine teeth, these cubs are enjoying their meal. Nashapai is a great mother. She is fearless and raising her cubs with proper training. She left the meal to her cubs and they have to learn how to eat faster. 90% of cheetah's hunts are a miss. If they hunt, they have to finish their meal faster and faster. As they are not like leopards to ambush and carry their hunt on top of a tree and keep it safe for a few days. At times, the hard hunt of cheetahs will be stolen brutally by a single hyena. Hyenas are extremely ferocious animals and can kill cheetah and their cubs. Nashapai is very smart enough to teach and train her cubs. Her cubs are growing healthy and she needs to take care of them. This conservancy has full of other predators like lions and leopards. Nashapai is blessed to be under surveillance of rangers 24-7. She and her cubs are being guarded day and night by the rangers to keep them safe from lions. Nashapai is very tired and she is resting so much but also having an eye around especially hyenas.